Thank you, Alan. Northwest Florida students go back to school on Monday, and it's a big day. But for some, the excitement of going back to school started today with a kind gesture from an NFL Hall of Famer. When students living in Pensacola Village and Gonzales Court go back to school Monday, they will have an added accessory on their backs, backpacks filled with school supplies. It's the latest gift from Pensacola native and NFL Hall of Fame linebacker Derek Brooks. Well, this community is somewhat of an underserved community, but what we're going to do is empower them and help them. Daryl Daniels is with Derek Brooks Charities. For the past 25 years, Brooks has given back to the community. He's from here and hasn't forgotten his roots. Derek Brooks believes that every child can achieve greatness. Every child can reach their full potential and no child is expendable. That's why we decided to choose this community because he's a product of this community. His lovely wife, Carol, is a product of this community who went to O.J. Sims Elementary School and they have never forgotten where they came from. Today's giveaway was held at the Woodland Heights Community Center, which sits in the shadow of Pensacola Village. Susan Sanders is the principal at O.J. Sims Elementary. She was here to support the moms and dads and her students. We have very little supplies come into the school from our families because there are some struggles there. We not only have enough backpacks for every one of our students, but we have an extra 125 for other students that may come, and so we didn't want to turn them away. Inside the center was the backpack giveaway. Outside were hamburgers and hot dogs, inflatables, and a community coming together. One of the community center's counselors summed it up best. This event is bigger than the money. It takes a village to raise a child, and so we're part of that. The Brooks giveaway is symbolic of this community. Students living in Pensacola Village and Gonzales Court spend a lot of time at the community center. It offers before and after school programs, meals, and one-on-one -on -one mentoring. We don't just stay inside. We go outside of these doors. And so we maneuver through the neighborhoods. We go through their schools as well. And so these children get a chance to see us and identify us, not just here at the community center, but in their everyday life. If you give them everything that they need to get a fresh start, it gives them a good foundation. So hopefully students will get what they're able to receive from the community here as their starting point, and they can flourish after that. Brooks has a couple of other surprises for the community and its students this fall. Stay tuned.